What's up, Jugglers? DC Fago guy. Uh, it's finally here. We got the Opaque Brotherhood by Dark Lotus. And I uh, hope you guys like my little teaser trailer that I did the other day. I wanted to do something cool like that. And I actually had a good idea for Amazing Jekyll Brothers, and the one for Dark Lotus just kind of came to me. Anyway, this was requested by Adam. I'm not, I have no idea how to pronounce your last name, so sorry about that, Ninja. But um, this came out in 2008. This is actually the first album. I got to see drop. I, I was a juggalo when Black Rain came out, but I didn't have my own money. Whereas this one, I was able to actually pre-order it and um, get this shit when it first come out. And um, this is not the deluxe edition. I would like to get the deluxe edition. As I see right now on Hatchet Gear, it's not on there anymore. So officially, it's going to become a rare CD. I'm hoping they put it back on, though, because I'd like to get it and do some custom work with this. But uh, there's the front. Well, there was the back. Here's the front. And uh, there is some differences between this one and the Deluxe Edition. I'm going to go ahead and link in Psychopathic Reviews. He's got the Deluxe one on there. Uh, the album art's different. And they don't have the Lotus behind there on the other one. Which kind of blows, if you ask me. That, that looks much sweeter. The book's a little different, too. This right here is actually that picture right there. So there's, there's definitely some differences between them. And of course, you got four bonus songs. So right in here, you got all your credits and whatnot, and all your internet link ups for MySpace and all the websites. And uh, then you start going into this tale about Dark Lotus and all this. I guess you could say almost like chance. I guess the Lotus, the Lotus can serve as therapy. The Lotus is pretty cool definitely something to look at and actually well, something that's pretty sweet about this I forget what these are they're like the uh, 8,000 warriors or something that was dug up and found in China and something cool about that is is when this album came out back in 2008 within like two or three months the uh, third mummy movie Tomb of the Dragon Emperor actually came out and had the same shit on it I thought that was so cool I was it had me all geeked because this came out and it had all these warriors on there and then that came out so we just do a quick flip over. You got the cover again and the back side of the cover. And just some ads for the gathering, DJ Clay and Crimson Creek. Which actually at the Opaque Brotherhood Tour, I actually did get the sampler for this. But I do not have it anymore because my brother got one too at the same concert and I gave mine to another juggalo. Just because I'm not selfish like that. Alright, so here we have the review of the packaging and whatnot. If you guys saw my teaser, you got the first, the actual intro, you got a little bit of a taste of that, which I wanted to do, which is another reason I did the sampler. And um, I've actually got the four songs that come on the delux deluxe edition because of my brother's wife, or the, his girlfriend at the time, they're married now, whatever, I don't give a fuck about that. But um, I'll go ahead and play those for you guys, even though this is not the deluxe edition. That way you can kind of make the decision of whether you want to get this one or if you want to try to find the deluxe one. I would recommend getting this one because of the packaging. Because the deluxe one has that fucking bar across. And that just kills it for me. I'm a big time fan of album art. You can ask anybody that knows me in person, man. When I do my iPod, it's got to have the album art on it. So, enough jibber jabbing. We're going to jump right in. You already heard the intro, so this is in bloom. It picks right up where the intro left off. We in bloom, many thoughts we arrange and pollens everywhere, that's the reason that we're changing. Stories hit the rise in the new times, taking lives, nobody survives. You got your hatchet going in the sky, five petals appear right before your eyes. Don't, don't get attached to your head like a neck, cause I'll disconnect, dark murders in effect. My side is water, burn the book's worst nightmare, though his petals going to shake something in the night. Man, he the guy that wicked this fan, he didn't, nobody can. You gotta follow the leader. We print and press the copy like Xerox machine stop it. Like mindless machines drop it. Put us down, find a new topic. Yo, we get your so good. It don't stop them, beat all our money. You think they're all just. Transcripts. 
steps, hidden in advancement. Last ditch at finding my Atlantis. Can't miss giving something to back with, but I'm throwing something no. We got black sand. A black sand storm is approaching the metropolis, sucking up sunlight and moves on top of us. Beaches of black sand are littered with dead fish. Black sand deserts grow blood red cactus. Dust devils twist human bodies in half. Black sand down the hourglass. That's our ass. This ain't the past that we live in. We're not forgiven. It's death at the hands of the lands we've been given. I'm already in sand, spill the essence of the black sand. The sight of no cause, trauma to a border land. Smoke starts rising and images appear. Our next victims death replace over in the mirror. Great to black sand, the coming of your end. All you ever loved is now a barren wasteland. Lost forever and still you would descend. You're caught between light and dark within the black sand. Garrett, can you keep a secret? Now we got Keep Up. This is probably my favorite off the album. Remember at the concert, Monoxide's all like, everybody jump up and down, and I did like three jumps, and my fat ass was like, that's enough for me. <laughs> Which trapped in the song. There's a witch trapped in this song. There's a witch trapped in this song. She'll hurt you, she'll haunt you, she'll curse you if she wants to. There's a witch trapped in this song. There's a witch trapped in this song. She'll hurt you, she'll haunt you, she'll curse you if she wants to. There's a witch trapped in this song. No hidden, hit the words of the Lord is marked forbidden. Don't memorize or repeat what I say. I've read the pen, started writing the blacked out for days. 
got the opaque brotherhood. Falling. This is my least favorite song. It's usually the one I always skip. Just didn't feel this one at all, man. Now I'm gonna skip through this little intro to it so you can hear. And we got trapped inside. This is definitely my second favorite. It's probably a tie between Keep Up for my first, but I definitely like this one a lot. It's a pretty badass song. Just talking about the different kind of ways of being trapped. One of them, uh, Jay's, he's trapped inside his mind. Shaggy had an operation, and you know he could feel it all, and he was gonna die. So. first listened to it I, I don't know why but I didn't I didn't like it and then I listened to it again and I was like damn I like this song and uh, we're gonna skip forward for you guys because we don't want to take up too much of our time because I got about a minute and I can't I don't think I can cover the, the four bonus tracks but I will go ahead and shoot another video after this one and then I'll probably link it in like I'll upload this one then relink that one into the description so um, yeah there you go guys like I said you can still find this one on Hatchet Gear the deluxe one though I think is actually going to become a rare CD now so but definitely get this one and then do what I'm going to do maybe try to find it for cheap highly doubt it I'll probably never have it. If I do get it, I want to do like a, uh, I'm going to put this in one of my two disc sets since it's, they're both different discs and have them flip like that. And then I'll probably set it up to where the other one has this part on the back so you can see the four bonus songs. But then put this one on top so you can still see that beautiful Lotus. But uh, plans that may not come true. But anyway, Joe Lowe's, there you go. There's Opaque Brotherhood by Dark Lotus. Definitely get it. It's good. Much clown love. Whoop, whoop.